him on Food Network, and he's here today to help us brush up on our knife skills. Please welcome Jet Tila. Thank you very much. Well, hello. Oh, I don't know what to do. No, no. uh, how about one of them? One of pow, these. Pow, pow. There it is. You're known as the fastest knife on the Food Network. That's right. Show us some of your knife skills. All right, are you guys ready? Yeah, we're ready. All right, uh, maybe the audience can help me clap in, in pace here. Ready? So let's go. Can you clap this fast? How's that? Is that fast enough? It's amazing. And always look down at your food, please. Don't don't be doing this. Yeah, this I mean, is not you're safe. just your eyeballs are rolling all over the place. <laughs> no, it's uh, years of practice, but there's a lot. There's ways to make it easy. What's okay, the promise. secret? Uh, the secret is first. Why don't we start with a grip? Okay. Right, okay. Why don't we start with the grip? Uh, it's called the pinch grip, and this is a chef's knife. Whoa, Kelly! Wow. This is typically wow. how I hold. This is, this is a different grip. This is how I hold a knife. I can see that. Okay. Yeah. Um, firstly, um, your thumb and your index on the blade, okay. actually on the blade, okay. right. and then roll your three fingers on the handle, and check <laughs> it out. The knife becomes a part extension of your arm. You get a maximum leverage this way. Oh, I like okay. that. If you're kind of French rocking, which we'll do, or you're Asian chopping, you can do both with this one grip right okay. here. Okay. All right. How, uh, so how do we do this without cutting ourselves? No problem. Um, guide hand is critical. Um, so just keep your, make sure, hey Mark, you're, you box, we yeah. box. Yep. Show me a defensive stance. All right, now take that defensive stance to the board. You're in the right position. That's it. Just remember that. You're, you're, you're oh, now check okay. it out. Because you're in that position, your your guide hand is at a 90 degree angle to your cutting hand, Kelly. There you go. So watch what I'll do. Let's let's make a tile always first. So let's cut a tile off and let the knife do the biting. All right, and then uh, let's grab just the little stem as we make a tile like that. And look, if you do it right. The, the stem pops right off. You go, girl. <laughs> Look at that. So aggressive. I like that. Now watch what we can do. Uh, now watch what you do. What okay. you do is make a finger fist. It's like kung fu again, right? Okay. Um, make, your, make your left hand into a fist. Okay. Roll your fingers under. Okay. All okay. right? And make sure your, your thumb never pokes out. And when you do that, um, and you pick a guide knuckle eventually, look, you finger fist, you'll never do it. I think Gelman and I just created a new knife term, by the way, finger fist. <laughs> now wait, stop there, wait, wait, watch this. Take that finger fist to the bell pepper. Stay inside, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a tile, fold it open, continue, roll, 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 and look what happens. Just like that. You got this, all right? Um, I'm already... Uh, sorry, Jet. Oh, what happened? No, I'm, 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 I'm learning. I got you, brother. Right, I got you. you. So, tile, so remember this rhyme, and you can cut anything. Okay. A tile becomes a slice. A tile becomes a slice. A slice becomes a dice. A, a slice, slice becomes, becomes a dice. dice. Okay, so we made a tile. Every knife cut falls into either a slice, which is Ooh. this, what we call a batonet or a julienne, anything that's long, ah. basically, right? And if we, look at you, Kelly. I didn't know you were looking Jet, at the look at finger. This. Look, at, oh, look at that. And they were like, and they were like, he's going to be nervous. But look at that. Finger, fist, thumb under, and boxing stance, and you got it. Because a julienne is a, is a, is a French fry. Hey. Right? right? Julienne. And I'm going to teach you one more. Take that, bro. We're Brian. I'm he's sorry. So look at that. Now take that julienne. Yes. Okay. And then cut it perpendicular. Again, remember, get that finger curled under, get that boxing stance, and remember, a tile became a slice, a slice becomes a dice now. Woo! That's it, it's that simple. So, we have all made small dices. If we make this slice, uh, the slice a little wider, now we'll go a half inch slice wide. Okay. And then we cut that perpendicular, you, now you've made a medium dice. I mean, again, on and on and on. What about right? cutting meat? Let's okay. cut meat. What cooking meat, real simple. Um, do me a favor, let the knife do all the work, right? Yes. So in, in this new show, 24 and 24, we took 24 chefs, gave them 24 channels, 24 hours, and they had to do this for 24 hours. Let the knife do the work. Look, um, again, finger, fist, let the knife bite. Oh, Don't incredible. start pushing down to the Thank knife. Thank you, Jay. Want to know more about anything you see on Live? Log on to our website at livewithkellyandmark.com.